down here to check him out. The white male, uh, white shorts, blue shirt, and a camera hanging around his neck. County 32, advised to be a white male wearing khaki pants, and he's got a camera. Meet Officer Donald LaCentra of the Orlando Police Department. On January 31, 2015, Officer LaCentra falsely arrested me for driving on a disqualified license. Officer LaCentra manufactured probable cause to make an invalid traffic stop and then lied on his official report of the arrest. From Officer LaCentra's narrative. On January 31, 2015, at approximately 11.21 hours, I, Officer LaCentra, ID number 18923, Conduct a traffic stop on a gray Dodge minivan bearing the Florida tag S152ME. I had run the tag prior to conducting the traffic stop and received a message on my mobile computer. The registered owner did not have a valid driver's license. The registered owner of the vehicle was Jeffrey Marcus Gray, a white male. The driver was a, of the vehicle was a white male. However, the documented truth contained in my video reveals that LaCentra did not call in my tag until after he had initiated the traffic stop. Listen closely. Officer LaCentra continues his lie by claiming that he initiated his traffic stop based on prior knowledge that my driver's license was not valid. From Officer LaCentra's narrative. I initiated a traffic stop based on my observations and knowledge that the registered owner did not have a valid driver's license, but the video clearly shows that Officer LaCentra claims he stopped me due to an obstructed tag. This is a traffic stop. Roll your window down all the way. What am I being stopped for? Your tag's obstructed, sir. Florida State statute requires that any portion of your tag cannot be obstructed. You see my hands. Okay. Keep your hands there. This is a traffic me. stop. Roll your window down all the way. What am I being stopped for? Your tag's obstructed, sir. Florida State statute requires that any portion of your tag cannot be obstructed. You see my hands. Okay. Keep your hands there for me, okay? So Officer LaCentra just claimed that Florida statutes requires that any portion of your tag cannot be obstructed. Well, let's have a look and see what the statute actually says. Florida Statute 316.605, Licenses of Vehicles, 1. All letters, numerals, printing, writing, and other identification marks upon the plates regarding the word Florida, the registration decal, and the alphanumeric designation shall be clear and distinct from, and free from defacement, mutilation, grease, and other obscuring matter so that they will be plainly visible and legible at all times, 100 feet from the rear or front. Now let's have a look at a picture of my license plate taken on the day of my arrest. The word Florida, the registration decal, and the alphanumeric designation are all clear and distinct and free from defacement. I need you to hop out of the car real quick for me, sir. Okay. Can you take my seatbelt off? Huh? Can you take my seatbelt off? Go ahead, take your seatbelt off. Would you like me to do? Sorry, I'll put the answer in the bed. Okay. Oops, sorry. We are placed under arrest for driving while license suspended with knowledge. You do not have a class C. You have knowledge that you do not have a valid CDL. Do you have anything on you that's going to poke me, trick me, cut me, hurt me at all, sir? Uh, no, sir. Do I take a camera with you or leave it in the car? I'll leave it in the car. Now Officer LaCentra is arresting me for a suspended license, even though my license is only in fact disqualified. Despite my efforts to explain to LaCentra that a disqualified license only means that I am no longer qualified to drive a tractor trailer and I am still able to drive my personal vehicle, LaCentra still arrested me and took me to the Orange County Jail where I would spend 12 hours behind bars. On Monday morning, I visited the DMV in St. Augustine to verify that my license is in fact valid and not suspended. Pay close attention, Officer LaCentra. 
your driving license is not under suspension. It's the DO, I mean, the CDL portion is disqualified. Okay. Um, and I just went over there to see if there was something that we can give you saying that the license was not under suspension okay. um, because the driving privileges were not. Um, and that's when I went to Brenda and she said Mrs. Hill was working on trying to get something together so we can help individuals you. like you, you to get that done. So what I'm going to do is I'll take a copy of your driver license. I want you to okay. write down your telephone number, okay. the best number to give you a call. And Mrs. Hill's not in today. And um, we'll, she's trying to get this set, um, trying to get this settled. And I cannot find the email that she sent out to everybody but Brenda has it and she's going to be forwarding it to me okay um, so I'm if you could explain it I, I'm, and I'm not trying to be a pain I'm just explain it to me like I'm like I'm a two-year-old like My... you're a two-year-old <laughs> you can't drive big trucks okay only only your passenger vehicle so is officer Lacentry a good cop protecting and serving the public from dangerous criminals or is he a liar who manufactures probable cause in order to put an innocent man in jail because that man committed the non-criminal offense known as contempt of cop Please give the Orlando Police Department a call and let them know how you feel about Officer LaCentra's actions.